Hello and welcome back to another Computer Sluggish tutorial. Today we're going to be taking a look at fixing Bluestacks 3 being laggy and glitchy when playing games. The first step of fixing this issue is to load up Bluestacks then go to the settings. To do this you need to go to the top right hand corner here press this little drop down and click on settings. Once you're on this screen we're going to go down to engine and once you're on engine you need to simply choose OpenGL for your graphics mode and for the CPU calls we're going to put that to the top. Your top may be 2 or it could be 4. If it's 4 then select 4 and for the memory we are going to whack this all the way up to the max. As you can see there I can choose 4096 which is absolutely great. What this is going to do is allow Bluestacks to use a lot more of our hardware. Once you've done this, you now need to click Restart Now. And Bluestacks will restart. Now jump in a game and see if that's improved the performance of Bluestacks. If it hasn't, don't worry, there's still a couple of other options we can do. Once you've tried out the game and if it is still laggy, you now need to go down to the bottom left hand corner of your screen. We're going to right click and go to Task Manager. Once you're on here, you're going to right click on Bluestacks and we're going to go to Go to Details. Once you're on Go to Details, we're going to right click on our Bluestacks.exe and we're going to go Set Priority and we're going to select the Above Normal option. Don't select any of the other options as this can cause unstable performance for other applications on your Windows and we don't want that to happen. Select above normal and we're going to click change priority. Now we're allowing Bluestacks to use even more memory of our computer and more CPU which is great, it give our games an extra boost. Now jump into a game and see if that's helped improve the performance of your game. If it hasn't, then the next option is looking at what antivirus program you have. If you have a fast, you can actually do one little tweak in the program, which may help. If you right click on a fast and we're going to go to open. Once you've opened up the user interface, you need to go to settings. And once you've clicked on settings, we're going to go down to troubleshooting. You now need to tick this box where it says enable hardware assisted fertilization. Basically what this is going to do is help improve the performance of our games as well because Bluestacks uses fertilization. Once you've done that, you will need to restart your computer. If you don't have this, well, if you don't have a fast, the other option is to try disabling your antivirus. To do this, normally you just right click, go to the fast shields or for another program, it'd be something shields control. And you're just going to disable it for an hour. Then try and run a game again in Bluestacks and see if that helped the performance. There is still one last thing you can try doing if none of these options has worked. You can go to the website where your graphics card comes from. For example, I've got a NVIDIA graphics card and you can try updating your graphics card drivers. Once you've done that, then obviously try running your games again. If that still doesn't work, then try looking for your motherboard drivers and just literally go through all the drivers on your computer and update everything. A good program to do this is a program called Driver Booster. I'll put the link in the description below and what that do is it automatically does all the updates for you. You don't have to keep going to each website and trying to find drivers yourself. I hope this tutorial helped. If it did, hit the like button below and subscribe for more computer sluggish tutorials.